Hello, toy fans and collectors everywhere. Welcome back. Today, we're doing our usual toy hunt. But uh, I'm in a different location. Uh, I'm in another state. And uh, let's go see what they got in uh, Walmart in Pennsylvania, shall we? Here we go. All right, everybody. Welcome back. Here we are. As every toy hunt usually begins in the media section. This is what I found on the end cap. We got some big pops here, mostly zombie related. Let's see what else we got as we make our way over here. Looks like we got some NECA. It's pretty cool. Those guys are a little bit too big for me to collect, but I really think that they're very, very beautiful figures. Let's see what else we got here. Terminator Judgment Day, some It. Best AXM, Dragon Ball, Gundam, Toonie Terrors. Let's see what kind of... Pretty much all the same Batmans here. That one's a little bit different. Some fig pins over here. All right, well, let's take a look right next to it. Here's some more pops. Got some pretty neat looking pops here. Never seen that one before. I've never seen that one either. So that's pretty neat. I'm not a super big pop collector myself, but I think they're really neat because you get all of the different lines in one thing. So if you want Avengers pop, you got Avengers pop. If you want He-Man pop, you got He-Man pop. I like how they kind of roll all that into one. So there's the pops there. I like those He-Man pops, they're pretty cool. A couple of plush items here, and then down at the bottom, we've got some more pops. And uh, every time I see that one, I'm always like hemming and hawing whether I should get it or not. Maybe one of these days I'll break down and get it, but so far I'm not seeing anything over here that's really catching my eye enough that I want to take home. So let's go over to the toys. All right, so we're about to go into the toy aisle right now, or should I say the boys toys, or older people toys. I'm not sure what kind of description I should use, but it looks like they got a couple neat looking things right here. Some nice Transformers here. Dinobot. Inferno. And let's see, we got some Studio 86. Really beautiful figures there. Some Starscream. Star screen. All right, go down here. This is really cool. I really think that that's awesome, and uh, I'm gonna grab that because uh, it's my favorite guy. And I haven't seen too many of them out there, so I want to make sure that I grab something. Oh, I uh, grabbed this as well. I just thought it was kind of neat. I like those kind of animal things as well every now and then all right as we go up though as you can see it's uh, kind of bare as we go up here Cheetor and uh, oh I almost dropped that no, I did drop that. oh my god oh my god everything just fell on the ground I just knocked everything down oh well okay so uh, that's pretty cool um, I already have her though 
got Cheetor as well. Um, but the, these are some nice figures, and I'm glad that they've got some stuff versus no stuff, which some of the other Walmarts that I've been to have. As you can see here, empty pegs. Um, casual Beyblade, Halo, Bakugan. I like those Halo figures, but they haven't come out with the next wave yet, so I can't wait for that. Um, we got we got all these different types of DC figures here, but I'm not seeing anything that I don't already have, so we don't need to spend a lot of time there. We got some DC Multiverse figures here. I'm gonna pick this up for a buddy of mine. He's really into uh, Batman, and uh, he's about to send me some video games. It's kind of a neat looking multiverse. Got all Wonder Woman there. Uh, what do we got down here? Pretty much the same one that we saw up there. Got some of this stuff here. DC sets. I like them, but they're a little just outside of my range. Although, you know, I don't have. Ooh, look at this. Look what I found. Oh, there's another one. Another one of Thomas Wayne. Um, I don't have this, and I do collect these, and I think it's pretty cool, but I think I'm gonna wait see if maybe the price goes down um, before I take a stab but uh, let's see what else we got here okay so Star Wars um, they got those little guys those little mission fleet guys um, I do not collect those either they're just outside of my thing and then that's cool we got the retro collection uh, we got a couple of them in there. I don't have any of those, but I don't collect the retro collection. I only collect the vintage collection because of the articulation. I don't seem to have any of those here. So, I guess we will move on. Some wrestling figures. WWE, Monopoly, We've got a ring down there, We've got a belt, and then some of those new Space Jam figures. But uh, let's move on to the next area here. Some plushies, got some Dungeons and Dragons. I can't wait for them to come out with more of those Dungeons and Dragons. Those ones are so cool. I wish they would come out with like three and three fourth inch Dungeons and Dragons related figures. They're very cool, but those things are kind of few and far between. I like those D&D um, &D style characters, those figures that uh, Vitruvian Hacks puts out, um, but they're rather pricey. and. I, they're never in the main stores. It's always in like a comic book store or something like that. And where I'm at right now, they don't have any place like that here. But here's the new uh, wave of the Marvel Legends. Um, they have quite a bit. It looks like they've got almost all of the new ones as part of that series. And as we go along here, Got the uh, predators and alien stuff, and uh, it's pretty cool. And uh, Fortnite, and then we've got um, Masters of the Universe. And as usual, all we've got is Wave One. Um, and I have currently all of those. I'm not sure if I have Tila. Um, 
not sure if I have Tila or not. I don't remember exactly seeing her in my collection when I was checking it the other day. Let's let's grab a Tila just in case. And in case I do have her, then I can always uh, return it or I'll sell it. Who knows? Skull crawler. Godzilla and King Kong, but it's so little. You know? I like the big ones. These ones are just a little too small. But, uh, alright, we've pretty much reached the end of the aisle here. And I've got some Jurassic Park stuff. And then, other than that, it's empty. So, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Um, this one was a short one. We did not walk out empty handed. This is our haul for the day. That's not bad. And um, if you like the video, please subscribe, give me a thumbs up, and uh, I hope you all have a great day. Take care. See you next time.